Hey guys, welcome back to Tony Zautus. In this video, I'll be showing you how to share a Unity project with someone. But before we start, hurry up and check out our latest self purchase under this video. So let's get started. So the first thing that we need to do here is we need to access Unity Hub. Now Unity Hub, it actually contains all the projects that we have on our account. But in this case, you should be able to see your project in here. So in this case, what we need to do is we need to use a specific setting or feature that is available in Unity. In this case, go to the project that you want to share. So for example, we have the new uh, My Project option here. Let's go and click on the tree dotted icon. And from here, let's go ahead and click on Use Unity Version Control. Now from this pop up here, you should be able to see your Unity Cloud organization, Unity version control organization repository and server location. So by the way, by default, you should have this one. So if you don't have it, you might need to create them uh, on your account first. So for this case, let's go ahead and click on connect to version control. It's going to create Unity version control organization and repository for us. So in this case, let's just wait for it to load up properly. Now, once it's actually fully loads up, you should be able to see your project here. And from here, as you can see, we now have a new tab that we could view. So in this case, we now have the Unity version control tab in here. In this case, you should be able to see all the assets that is available here. So in this case, if you want to share this project here, what you need to do is you need to go to the top right of this tab here. As you can see, you should be able to see a person icon. So this is going to be the invite members to organization. So let's go ahead and click on it. Once you click on it, it should open up a new tab, which in this case, it's going to give you the Unity Cloud. In this case, we need to sign in into our account. Let's go ahead and click on sign in first. Now from here, let's go and provide all the credentials. Now, once you're signed in, you should be able to see your UI here. As you can see, we have different seats on a Unity version control. Now, currently we are, or we only have three assignable seats. And currently we only have one seat available or one seat that we actually assigned to ourselves. So in this case, let's go and click on assign seats at the top right of your screen. And from here, you just need to provide their email address. So for example, I'm going to add the specific user's email. And from here, what we need to do is we need to indicate either if they're an admin or not. So if they're not an admin, make sure to uncheck this. But if they are, you can go ahead and click on admin. Now from here, let's go ahead and click on assign seats. Now, once you've assigned a seat for them, they should be able to start accessing your repository here. Now, if you want to edit their permissions or remove them from uh, you, the, their access on the specific project, you can go ahead and just click on the tree dotted icon here and click on edit user. Now from here, you should be able to change their permissions, like for example, the add option, apply attributes, and uh, if you want to change the repository permissions as well, you can go ahead and do that. Now, if you want to revoke their admin access, you could go ahead and click on revoke admin access, or if you want to remove them from this organization, you can just go ahead and click on remove from organization. And that's about it. So in this case, that's how you share Unity projects with someone. And if you found this video helpful, hit the like and subscribe button and watch our next video.